Hey everyone, Tony here again with Genuine Comfort. I want to talk about today the difference in heat between an 80% efficient furnace and a 95% efficient furnace. And um, a 95% efficient furnace, because of the way they're marketed, sounds like it's a really good idea. And they are wonderful, wonderful furnace. No matter which brand you get, they, you know, they all will vent the same and they all will produce the same amount of heat on a 95% on any brand. Now, that being said, 95% efficient furnaces burn cooler. Therefore, that's why they're ran in PVC and they condensate. And an 80% furnace, when you put your hand over the registers, will actually feel a lot warmer than a 95% furnace. And the reason why this is so important is Anytime I go into a customer's home and they're elderly, unless they specify what they want as far as a high efficiency furnace, I don't like to go down that path of offering them a 95% efficient furnace because a lot of times they're so used to their old furnace and it produces so much more heat. Of course, number one, it's usually oversized, but when they're inefficient like that, they're used to that heat. And if I take them and I put them in a 95% efficient furnace, a lot of times they're just cold all the time and um, anyway it could just cause problems again that's not every circumstance but uh, if you're wanting heat and you like the heat an 80% furnace is gonna burn and feel a little bit more warmer than a 95% efficient furnace anyway Tony Bassett genuine comfort have a wonderful day